console room heaters, also known as vented hearth heaters, are a great way to heat smaller apartments and homes without using any ductwork. They operate with natural gas and LP gas if you buy the optional LP conversion kit and work really well, especially when compared with a traditional convection style space heater. The reason for that is these furnaces have a blower in them that can be turned on at a couple of different speeds to increase how quickly that furnace heats the room. These units come in a nice black small compartment that will sit unobtrusively in the side of the room or you can even upgrade them to have a nice fireplace look to them. This model here has the glass panel in front with the ceramic logs right inside the heat exchanger so when the furnace kicks on you'll actually see the flames adding ambiance to any room. Now the heat, the air is pulled in through the bottom of the furnace here and then pushed if the blower is on up through and across that heat exchanger through louvers here at the top of the unit. You can see them here including the heat exchanger down inside. Now if we continue around you can see the access panel here where you can get into the unit for service or cleaning. Now because of that panel you'll want to leave at least about 24 inches clearance from any wall or other object so that you can get at that point. On the back of the furnace you can see the gas valve where you'll plumb in the gas line. Also thermostatic control connections where you can actually hook up the thermostat that comes with every one of these furnaces. It's a wall mounted thermostat. They also include the control wiring that you'll use to wire from that thermostat to the unit. Now that's not 24 volt connection, it's simple millivolt connection, so it's very easy to work with. Back to the furnace, you can see here the typical 110 volt grounded plug that plugs into a traditional receptacle to power that blower. Up here on the top of the unit, you can see the fan switch. So if you want the fan on, you can turn it to either low or high speed. Moving back down here, we have the push button spark. If you push that spark button, it'll light the pilot light for you, keeping it very simple. Also is the exhaust connection. You'll want to plumb that exhaust to the outside, following the manufacturer's installation manual and, of course, national venting code. This type of furnace is a great unit, especially for those smaller homes or apartments. They're simple, easy to install, and work great in a rustic cabin or an addition to your home. Mm -hmm.